the information you need relating to the sport you love, all within five minutes. NASCAR 5 starts right now. Hello everyone, welcome to NASCAR 5. I'm your host Bryce Turner. This weekend, NASCAR races at Bristol. A look at the schedule coming up, but first a look back to the races at Mid-Ohio and Bristol. In the Xfinity Series Mid-Ohio Challenge, Justin Marks took the victory. Sam Hornis Jr. and Ryan Blaney finished second and third. Meanwhile, Elliot Sadler continues to lead in the standings over Daniel Suarez and Ty Dillon. Ben Kennedy won the UNOH 200 Truck Series race from Bristol. Brett Moffitt and Daniel Hemrick rounded out the top three. William Byron continues to lead in the standings over Hemrick and Johnny Sauter. It's time now for a news update. In the news, William Byron has signed a multi-year driver agreement with Hendrick Motorsports. As part of the deal, Byron will run full-time in Xfinity next year for Hendrick affiliate Junior Motorsports. Byron has five wins so far in his rookie season in the Camping World Truck Series where he's driving for Kyle Busch Motorsports. He won the championship last year in the k and Pro Series East. In other news, a couple of Sprint Cup drivers spent their off weekend competing in an Ironman. Trevor Bain and Landon Castle competed in an Ironman in Dublin, Ireland. The event featured swimming, biking and running. Bain finished 479th overall with a time of 5 hours, 25 minutes and 10 seconds. Castle finished 216th with a time of 5 hours, 2 minutes and 38 seconds. This was Bain's first Ironman and Castle's fifth. Ricky Stenhouse Jr. will pay tribute to Brian Clausen this weekend with a special paint scheme. Stenhouse will run the fastenal scheme that Clausen raced during the 2008 Xfinity season. Clausen, at the age of 27, died earlier this month following a crash in a midget race. And programming alert, this weekend the NASCAR Pinty Series races at Riverside International Speedway. Riverside was designed as a smaller version of Bristol Motor Speedway and oddly enough there will be NASCAR racing at both tracks on Saturday night. Tune into Can Race for Pinty Series pre-coverage including driver Q&A and a comparison between Riverside and Bristol. That can be seen now on my YouTube channel. The Xfinity Series is up first this weekend with the Food City 300 from Bristol Motor Speedway. The race will take place tonight at around 7.45 p.m. Eastern with broadcast coverage on USA Network, TSN2, PRN, and Sirius XM. Qualifying is set for today at 3.15 and can be seen on the NBC Sports app and Comcast Sportsnet stations in Mid-Atlantic, Bay Area, and Northwest. Then tomorrow night, it's the Sprint Cup Series Fast Pro Shops NRA Night Race from Bristol. The event will take place at about 8.15 p.m. Eastern with broadcast coverage on NBCSN, TSN5, PRN, and SiriusXM. Qualifying is set for today at 5.45 with TV coverage on USA Network. Thanks for watching this week's edition of NASCAR 5. I'm Bryce Turner. Enjoy the races.